everybody welcome back to my channel today I'm going to show you my chickens yeah so first I'm gonna go to old to small chickens so here are the old girls Blackie's the black one Violet is right there and then Carob so the two right here are uh, Rhode Island red chickens and the other one over here is Blackie. Well, her real name is Blackberry, but I call her Blackie for short. She is a Partridge Plymouth Rock, so she's skittish more. Um, Partridge Plymouth Rocks can lay, like, all sorts of kinds of eggs, but, yeah, so they can lay, like, green, blue, you know. And the Rhode Island Reds will lay light brown eggs, like, bright brown. She usually lays cream-colored eggs, and over here are our new chickens that we just got yesterday. Here we go. So that little one right there, that cute little one, is named Misty. She's a California tan. We don't know what egg she's lays yet because she's still a chick, but she, she she will eventually come around. The one right there is Snow. She's a barred rock chicken. Have you ever heard of barred rocks not being nice to other chickens? Um, well, I was wondering why is she being bossy to the other chickens? It's because she's a barred rock and that's their breed. They are like kind of bossy to other chickens, but I mean, they're overall, they're really, really sweet to people. She, I can almost take her, like she's a good companion. Over there next to her is Goldie. She lays green eggs and the barred rocks lay light brown eggs. So uh, she's a golden comet chicken. Golden Comets will usually lay green or blue, so she lays green eggs, we're pretty sure, but none of them have actually started laying, but we think, oh, she lays green, she lays, you know, light brown, just for example. And, yeah, Goldie is skittish because she's, like, more wild, because Golden Comets are wild. If they lay pink, green, or blue eggs, then they're more wild and more skittish. These chickens will usually like to hang out in their groups of three while these hang out together because these chickens, they'll all come around the corner eventually. It took them three, no, well, it took Blackie because Blackie was first. It, them two were always hanging out, but then Carib and Blackie started being friends and yeah, they eventually came around the corner. These three will come around the corner. And over here, I'm going to show you the chicken coop and the chicken water and everything. So let's could just know. Uh, for our seed, we usually will do pellets, but they're crumble, actually. They're called crumble. Crumble is a little thing, they're like, they're like pellets, except they're more, uh, littler pellets, so it's easier for them to eat. So, they'll do, we'll do crumble. It's basically mixed up proteins for the chickens. They like it. They, they love, they love it. Misty, they love it. They, sorry, Misty is pecking me. They, they absolutely love the crumble. So, yeah. And here is the chicken water. It's pretty clean, I guess. And we do usually do this seed in the after, afternoon. We will do a half, a, cu a full cup of this seed. It's just like little seeds, you know, corn and stuff like that. And in the afternoon, and then we'll do a cup of in the morning. Do a cup of crumble in the morning and a cup of that seed in the afternoon. The chicken coop. Here is the chicken coop. There, it's pretty clean because whenever I did new chicken, whenever we got new chickens, I usually cleaned the coop, did the water, and did the seed perfectly so they could feel at home, you know, so they're secure. Which I actually, well, I'm not going to get into that yet because this is just supposed to be a tour of my chickens. But I will talk about it in my next video, the five top things that you need for your chickens and the five top things that you need for your new chickens. So, yeah. And over here, see, the chickens are still hanging out. These chickens are hanging out together. So I am just really happy that we are our new chickens because I was thinking, oh, I hope they're friendly. Like, California tans are really friendly, same with Baird Rocks. But if you guys want friendly chickens, I suggest Rhode Island Reds, Plymouth Rocks, Baird Rocks and California Tans. Oh, sometimes Easter Eggers are really friendly. Also. Oh, and Americanas, Americanas. Those are the chickens that you should get if you want friendly chickens. If you want sturdy chickens, like hardy, they're easy, 
like, they don't really, like, they're, they're, they're sturdy chickens, basically. I suggest, uh, partridge Plymouth Rocks and Plymouth Rocks and Easter Eggers. Those are all sturdy chickens. They, 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 they will not get Bumblefoot, like, because there's a disease called Bumblefoot that, uh, the Rhode Island Reds got, Blackie and Carob, because their coop is dirty. So, yeah, if you, you guys really want to prevent your chickens from getting Bumblefoot, then you should just, you know, make sure the coop is clean at all times. If you guys are just watching this for fun, and you just want to be like, oh, I like watching her chickens, you know. <laughs> so, you guys should just go to my other videos also. I have cute chickens, like my new Goldie, my new chicken Goldie, my new Goldie chicken, whatever. <laughs> and so, yeah, I took, like, videos of Snow, Goldie, Misty, you know, because I want to, like, tell everybody about the chickens. <laughs> And then, no, uh, let's go see my cat. Her name is Callie. She's a tortoise shell cat. And she basically, uh, she, well, tortoise shell cats, I am basically a cat expert. Here, let me just close this gate really quick. Oh my gosh, this gate is horribly hard to close. There, perfect. Wait, hold on. Sorry, guys. I, I have to close this so the chickens won't get out. So basically, Callie is a tortoise shell, and tortoise shell cats are, most of them are actually females. There's barely any male tortoise shell cats, fun fact. And also, uh, tortoise shell cats are very territorial. They will, like, they don't like other cats, and sometimes they will spray in the areas, or they'll rub their face against you to mark their scent. I don't know if she's under the car. Oh, here she is! So yeah, here's Callie. She has a cute little collar, as you all know. She's adorable. Okay. Oh, good girl, Callie Cows. There she is, there's Callie. So that's basically my pets. Thank you so much for watching, and please check out my other videos, please. They're awesome. Okay, bye everybody.